Hi everyone, this is Indiana Jack. Once again, something unique for you, something you're not seeing every place and on every channel. You are seeing a 2020 Volvo that's very unique. In fact, I drove by a Volvo the other day and I ran in there because I saw this truck and I said, hey, can I get some shots of this truck and show the audience? I knew that you would like to see it. So let's do in the tradition of what we do here, show you exactly what's in this 2020 Volvo 860. We have a Volvo D13 455 for the engine. Nice. And this particular tractor comes with a backup camera. That's awesome. So you can, when you're backing up to your trailer, hooking up, you can be right there, see what's going on. I really like that. I'll bet you soon it will be on all vehicles. It is on my personal vehicle, but it's neat, uh, neat having it in a truck. All right, let's look inside and check it out. I've been driving a Volvo for 12 years and definitely this is the biggest change since I've watched them uh, since way back in 2005. Awesome. What this is is a cup holder right here two of them actually and they're movable this is a little track and you can move it where you want i'm six five i'm not gonna have the same setting as a guy that's a short guy at five nine uh, so now my knee isn't gonna always be banging into this thing like it did on old red for all those years now it can be moved wherever you wherever you want it to with these little, uh, see how that works? You press that little clamp or that button and then it grabs onto the side of that and you can move it wherever you want. I know these are just cosmetic things, um, but it's, you know, sometimes you gotta see that. It's the cool thing that uh, even though it seems trivial, it's important to a truck driver. They have redesigned the entertainment system. Um, it's awesome too. I mean, you can do everything with it. You would think that would be a back button. I guess it's not. How about home? There we go. So it interfaces with your phone. The internet comes up also. Oh, that's great. <laughs> um, they have finally redesigned these buttons, which I've been complaining about for years. Um, they're awesome now. It doesn't look like they're going to 
the old ones would break out and then there would be a big hole there. Just just the trivia. There's so much to see here. It looks like a, a cockpit of a 777. some little things I've noticed like in the door alone they've added little lights all over the place so you can see in the little cubby hole here and underneath so when you're uh, trying to get up at it when it's you know like 20 20 below zero freezing cold and you're stumbling for the keys you can actually light up what you're seeing here getting in your truck that's awesome just some of the little details they've added uh, are great features some of these are the same. The above the driver is just about the same. And the traditional uh, skylight. Okay, now let's see what the sleeper looks like. Wow. Awesome. got a nice uh, top bunk that's a pretty thick mattress for a truck It's got a cabinet up there and a, a cubby hole here, a couple of drawers, socks and underwear, refrigerator down there. And let's go around to this side. What do we got over here? Same thing, cubby hole at the top, cabinet. Then we got a TV mount right here. A closet. And then a little one at the bottom. And then a seat. Or a bed, whatever you want to use it for. And they've added room in the back. Um, my stomach doesn't overlap this chair or this uh, table, which it has in others. This is very comfortable. I feel like I'm in a restaurant or something. Nice. Look at the steering wheel. This is awesome. You can do everything right here. Oh look, they even have a way to uh, cook a bologna sandwich right here on the steering wheel. I don't think anyone else has that. And the transmission is a Volvo iShift 12 speed. The uh, controls are in the dash. It doesn't have the little gear shifter thing on the side of your seat. So if you like that, you... Uh, don't have that in this Volvo, but it does have it on the dashboard. Won't be any trouble shifting at all. Thanks for riding along on this awesome trip on this uh, black Volvo. I would love to have this truck, and maybe you would like to have it too. Here's how you can actually contact this dealership right now if you're interested in this truck. It's available here in right near Calhoun. I will put the address below in the show notes so that you can click on the link for information about it. Thanks for riding along. I'm Indiana Jack, and we will see you next time.